Hello? Is anyone there? I'm not sure where I am, and I could use some help. Ella, I didn't expect you to be up so early. I just couldn't wait any longer to continue my book. Oh? What is it about? It's a fantastic tale about this heroic adventurer who's trying to reunite a lost child with their mother. I'm only halfway through, though, but I can tell it's building up to something. I just wish your mother could have seen who you are today. Mm -hmm. Every day. I know she misses you too, Father. Ella, I need you to watch the farm for a couple hours. Where are you going? I need to run into town to take care of some business. So, you think you could do that for me? <laughs> of course. That's my girl. Excuse me, child. <gasps> Please, don't hurt me! No, no, no. I, I wouldn't dream of it. What do you want? I... I need help. What makes you think I can help? I don't know. I I'm just so lost. Lost? I have no idea where I am or, or how I got here. I need help. Finding my way back, wherever that may be. Finding your way back? I can be a hero! All right, I'll help you. Amelia, and I thank you. Ella. Why are we back here? According to the hero in this book, the first thing she did when approached with the mystery of the missing child was to retrace the child's steps. So, we're going to retrace your steps. Oh, great. I'm a lost child in your fantasy tale. This is the spot? Just as I remember it. Hmm. Are you sure you don't remember anything else? I'm sure. This was the exact spot I remember waking up at. Everything else before is just gone. Okay. This is going to be a tougher case than I thought. I guess we should look down there. What's wrong? I don't know. There's something here, but I, I can't explain it. Try. I feel warmer somehow. I feel like something is pulling me toward that cottage. Is that your home? No, I don't think so. But it feels familiar, like I've been here before. I don't think I can do it. In the face of fear, a hero must show courage. Uh, it's unlocked. Are you sure you want to do this? If this will help you, then yes. Any of this 
ringing bells? No, but something is here. I can still feel it. I don't know what you're feeling, but hopefully it's something good. What could it be? Is it the fireplace? No. Besides, there's no fire going. This feeling, it's not like how a fire warms your skin. It, it, it's like a warm feeling inside yourself. We could try looking in the back. Is it done? Yes, the wheelbarrow's loaded and ready to go. Excellent. Are you sure about this? Of course. What's not to be sure about? There is no turning back now. We could bring attention to the... Arthur, there is no need. Remember, you will be well paid after this is done. Why is my father here? Who is he talking to? Geppetto. He's the town's top craftsman, but you can't trust a man like him. What do you think they were talking about? I don't know, though it can't be good if Geppetto's involved. What should we do? We should follow them. That's what the hero in my book would do. Ella. What is it? I feel strangely cold. Do you need a blanket or something? This feels different. It's like that warm feeling I had before has been replaced by this ice-cold feeling. Let's hurry up and follow them. The quicker we solve this, the quicker you can go back to feeling normal. I hope. Where did they go? And why was my father there in the first place? Ella, I think it's getting worse. I'm freezing now, and I've never felt as lost as I do now. Hang in there. We'll figure this out. I just need to find... We just need to find clues. But what clues? Look around us. What clues could we find out here in the middle of the night? I'm sure something will come up. You think that a clue is magically going to surprise us? Maybe not surprise, but... But I'm sure there is something we're missing. And it's only a matter of time till... Ah! Uh! Uh! Are you alright? Wheel marks. They went this way. What did I tell you? I don't understand. The tracks end here. Ella, I feel it again. The cold? No, the warmth is back. And so is that force that was calling to me back in the cottage. Whatever was there is now here. That's good? Now, we just have to find what is calling to me. Could it be... Amelia? Amelia, it's time to come up now. <sighs> okay, you can do this. <gasps> I don't understand. None of it makes sense. What do you mean? Why didn't you tell me? Tell you what? Tell me that I was... A ghost? I thought you knew. I guess deep down I did. But I didn't want to believe it. 
At least we found your body. I know, but I still feel lost inside. Like something's still not right. I feel empty. I just can't believe- Amelia! I promised you that I would help you figure this out to the end. And I still plan to do so. We found the body. It's case closed. Go home, Ella. But we haven't made this right! There's nothing else to do. I needed your help finding my way back. Well, there is no way back. I'm a ghost. And you helped me find my body. I thank you for that. But the adventure is over. You can go home. I'll just wander in this forest. No, I made you a promise, and I'm sticking to it. You're a bright girl. Don't let yourself get carried away by the fantasies of a book. It's not about the book. At least not anymore. I don't want to help you because that's what a character from a book would do. I want to help you because that's the person my mother would have wanted me to be. Wanted? My mother passed away when I was young. But this is what she would want me to do. This promise is from me, who I am, not what a book told me to do. This isn't right. Relax. What's done is done. Are you sure no one knows? Yes. And no one will find out? Yes. No one will ever know about what we've done. I can't. This will eat me alive. Pull yourself together. There is nothing to worry about. We handled the situation without suspicion. Besides, the woman was a nobody. A drifter who didn't know better. Please, Geppetto, let's turn ourselves in and clear our conscience. My conscience is clear. You knew what was at hand, and you chose to take the task. He who is paid in full has no room to speak loosely. I never thought I'd see my own grave. Have you ever stood before one? Like up close? Only one time. My mother's. How'd it go? I think I was too young to realize what was happening at the time. And now? I still don't fully understand. I don't think anyone ever does. That's nice. What now? Well, now's usually the time where people speak about the person that's passed. You know, talk about how great they were and all that. You want me to talk about how great you are? Keep going. How great was I? Amelia was so great that I am still helping her in the afterlife. And she is the greatest friend ever. How is that? <laughs> That'll do. So great adventurer. What now? I promised you I would help you get to the bottom of this, and I intend to do so, starting with my father. Uh, father? I've done something terrible. Go on. Believe me when I say, I only had the best intentions in mind. Father, what did you do? I helped Geppetto dispose of a body. Father, how could you murder someone? No, there was no murder, at least not from me. I was only hired to help get rid of the body. Why, Father? Why did you do this? I had no choice. 
Geppetto asked for my help, but never told me what the job was. But why did you go through with it? We needed the money. But this is nothing but blood money. Please, darling. I know I did wrong, and I understand it now. You must forgive me. I forgive you, father. But you must help us right this wrong. We have to bring justice to the one responsible, Geppetto. I don't know if that's such a good idea. Father, he can't get away with this. He has to face the consequences. The man is too powerful. No one will believe our word. Even showing the body to the guards will put us under suspicion, and even in the dungeons. What if it's not our word? What do you mean? They can't put us under suspicion if it's not our word. I'll walk you through it. Are you sure this will work? I'm sure. What was that? I just said I'm sure this will work. I do hope so. Okay, let's split up and put this plan into action. How come my father can't see you? I will make my presence known only when I think the time is right. So far, you're the only one I trust. Thanks again for all of this. Thank me when this works. Hello, little girl. Is something the matter? Sir, I, I must tell you, I heard of a terrible murder that's been committed near a cottage in the forest. This is a grave accusation. Did you see this happen? No, but many people in town have been talking about it. Could you investigate this? I, I fear the worst, and I know I won't be able to sleep at night with a murderer on the loose. You say this is spreading through the town? Y yes sir. Hmm. We can't have panic building amongst the citizens. Okay, I will gather my partner and we will investigate this matter right away. Thank you, sir. That's nice. How'd it go? They bought it. But do you really think Geppetto will confess? I don't plan on him to. He will most likely play innocent. But this will put the pressure on him. He will have no choice but to directly confront us. Why would we want that? Trust me, I have everything under control. If all goes accordingly, Geppetto will squeal soon enough. You really are your mother's daughter. Hello, officers. What can I help you with? May we come in? I have no reason to say no. May I ask what is going on? We've received word that a murder has been committed in this forest. Oh my, what terrible news. Have you gotten any leads? No, but fear not. We will get to the bottom of this. I sure hope so. Please, officers, if there's anything you need, I am here to help. We've received word that a murder has been committed in this forest. Have you seen anything unusual as of late? I can't say I have. Everything looks clear. I'm sorry for this intrusion, sir. No worries. I just hope you guys catch this maniac. Rest assured, this maniac won't get away. Have a good night. Good night, gentlemen. This isn't good. What is the meaning of this? Geppetto, please. My daughter is in the room. I don't care. What were you thinking sending the officers to my house? Did you think I would confess? I did not send any officers after you. Don't play coy with me. 
We are the only ones who know about this. I believe there may have been another witness. You mean to tell me the witness is a ghost? If that's the case, we really are in the clear. What? I do believe you've upset the ghost. This can't be real. It's nothing but an illusion. It's locked. Your... Your... Confess. Please don't hurt me. Confess your crimes or live a life filled with terror and despair. Yes, yes. I, I, will, I will confess. Just don't hurt me. I beg of you. Go. I confess! I confess! I confess! I confess! Thank you, Ella, for everything. You are my hero. You are the ghost that my daughter's been helping? Yes, I'm Amelia. I'm the woman whose body you helped dispose. I sincerely apologize, Amelia. Can you forgive a foolish old man? After seeing the kind of girl you've raised Ella to be, I forgive you. And Ella, you were the greatest friend I've ever had. Trust me when I say, your mother is prouder than you could ever imagine. If I made you a handsome clock, would you free me? Bribes don't work here, especially not in the form of a clock. Please, I'll even throw in a chair. Ooh, save it for the next guard. My shift is up. So, you do want the clock. Please, I confessed. What more do you want from me? I know, Geppetto. But let's have a talk, shall we? <laughs>